Hi guys, this is Rusty78609 in my luxurious 16 foot travel trailer in Central Texas, USA planning my RV trip coming up in the middle of March. And notice that this is my 3.1 cubic foot refrigerator in my 16 foot Coachman Clipper Cadet 2018 and it's a 110 only refrigerator, 110. It's not a three way, two way, it's a one way, 110 volts. So when I'm dry camping or boondocking now, uh, what I'm going to do is, this up here is a 10-pound bag of ice. I just put it in there. This is a spearmint, an experiment. I call it a spearmint, like the chewing gum. And what I'm going to do is see how long that bag will last in this refrigerator using it as a ice box. Okay? And I've got the refrigerator off, and I've got a temperature gauge right down there, and we're going to see what temperature... It will hold the fridge. I was going to use this to put the ice in, and it fits barely. And I thought, well, that way if the bag had a leak, blah, blah, blah. But what I did was I just double bagged the 10-pound bag of ice. So anyway, from Central Texas, USA, this is Sunday morning, February the 4th, at about 9 a.m. approximately. And whenever that bag of ice, right here, 10-pound bag of ice, I just put it in there. I'm hoping I can get four days out of it, and, and I've also, again, I've got it double bagged, so if it, when the ice melts, I won't have a, a, a RV full of water. But I've also got, in addition to this, this is just going to be where I want to keep stuff cool, okay? Like, uh, you know, some veggies and stuff. And then over here, I've got my Dometic CF-18 12-volt refrigerator, which I'll run off my solar and my uh, uh, battery. <clears throat> And I've got some stuff in there. I've got some berries and stuff. And I can use this a fridge. Right now I've got it set on about 35 degrees. And that's kind of in between a freezer and a refrigerator. But no, that's good. But the two together will work perfectly because that way I can have, you know, veggies, fresh veggies and all that stuff. Don't have to eat a lot of canned stuff. But anyway, just wanted to give you a heads up. This is my experiment. Central Texas, USA. Thumbs up. Carpe diem. Adios. Bye, bye, bye. Anything you want. But if you think about it, use the link. To the to Amazon products in my in the description of my videos. Why? Because I'm an Amazon affiliate, and uh, I get a small commission. And while I'm finishing up here, I'll let y'all see how my luxury. Here's the the 12 volt TV. Got some stuff up there. Not much. Those mirrors are held on by a, a two 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 edge tape. There's a little bulletin board. But anyway, uh, stretch, walk, take deep breaths, drink plenty of water. Use the Amazon link bed's not made <laughs> i hear you the bed's hard to make i have to admit that you know it's you can't get all the way around it but it believe me i'll make it here in a little bit and there's some more mirrors and uh anyway uh there's my stuff for putting some uh, veggies and stuff fruits and veggies bananas and stuff and then here's all my my cookware right there that's a magnetic thing that holds all my cookware. I don't have any. I don't have any drawers. No drawers anywhere. Okay. No drawers. No drawers. No drawers. No drawers. And then up there is all my stuff. And when I get ready to go, there's a little uh, board that fits right across here and, and holds all that stuff in there. Uh, this stuff doesn't move. And anyway, this is it, guys. This is my home. And uh, anyway, notice the door's missing there. Okay. But if you ever take the door off one of these, just remember there's a little button right down there, and that little button uh, w enables. In other words, when that button is pushed in, it keeps the furnace, uh, or when it pops up, it keeps the furnace from cutting on. So what, did you, what you have to do, you have to take that out and wire those wires together. But anyway, uh, this is it, guys. This is my whole home, my whole house, my whole everything. But anyway, from Central Texas, USA, this is Rusty, and he's experimenting using a 10-pound bag of ice starting today. The high today is supposed to be around 78, 79, so it's a good day to start. So anyway, y'all y'all have a good day. Drink plenty of water, stretch, walk, take deep breaths, do all that stuff, and use the Amazon link in the description if you think about it. I appreciate it. Adios, amigos. Bye-bye.